Damn, you look so beautiful. You're far beyond the usual. And baby, don't forget, you're not an accident. You light up every room you walk in. All the hearts you touch start falling. And no one will forget, everywhere you've been. I'm going to write a love letter to myself you're gonna hear it hear it love letter to myself you're gonna hear it right now yeah. cool. hello everybody um i see a lot of familiar faces in here which is really awesome um, I think, as Herbie mentioned, I am signed to a record label, BMG Records. And um, when I had signed with them in 2018, I had no idea what direction I was going to head into. And I was already struggling with my self-image, and I just felt very lost. Um, uh, the reason why I want to talk about my record today is because not only do I express myself best through music, but I know that all of you will be able to relate to the messages in these songs. Um, so the first song I would like to talk about is a song that I wrote called Love Letter. Love Letter, I wrote it with a wonderful uh, group of people, um, Nellie Reeves, she's in a band called Gone West, and also um, Mark Solomich. Um, I went in there not knowing what the heck I was gonna write about, and I was just, struggling with my body image, and I was just so tired of being so mean to myself and negative in my head. And the first words that came out of me was, this is the last time. Uh, and you'll hear that later in the song. Love Letter is about being tired of being negative and just wanting to be confident and knowing that it's okay to be confident. And um, when I sing the words, I am reminding myself and I'm reminding other people that it is okay to want to, to love yourself and to be confident in yourself no matter what. Um, the second song I would like to mention is a song that I wrote called Speak Up that Herbie mentioned. Earlier was my first single I ever released. Um, that song, I was bullied online. I never thought I could ever be bullied. I heard about it and whatnot, but I never thought it would you know, uh, happen to me. Uh, so when it did happen, I was really startled by it. And uh, I realized this person was trying to take my voice away from me. Uh, they were saying terrible things about me online. And uh, I wanted to respond to them, but I knew if I were to do that, I'd be giving them exactly what they want from me. And so I did not do that. Instead, I talked to my mentors and I just did what I do best. I wrote a song about it, Speak Up. Not only is Speak Up about, um, not only is it, uh, anti-bullying anthem, but also it is about being able to say how you feel. Sometimes we are all in situations where we feel shut down and we can't, we don't feel free to express our mind. So speaking up is being able to just speak up when, when you need to and um, don't be afraid to. Uh, the last song I will want to talk about before I get into my set with my guys. Real quick, to shout out to my boys who play with me. Uh, I have Kevin here today, um, Steve to Steve, and David Hawkins. They all work really hard for me, and I just love those boys so much. Um, <clears throat> Nothing Left to Say is a song that came very easy to me. Uh, I wrote it in JR's basement with Jeff and JR. Um, it came easy to me because I just, it has never been in me to give up. I've never given up without a fight. Um, for example, I was running at Chalco Hills in uh, Millard, and I was running the four mile track. And uh, I was about three miles into it, and I noticed this guy holding, like, running with a stroller in his hand, and he had a child in the stroller, and he was starting to run faster than me. And he was like, he just passed me like 50 feet. And I was just like, what the heck? Like this guy has a stroller. Like how is he running that fast? 
And then I started comparing myself to him and I wanted to give up. I was like, why am I even running? You know, and then um, it hit me. Uh, I realized in that moment that I shouldn't be comparing myself to this person. They are, they have their own timeline and I have my own timeline. So I did not give up. I finished the race in, in my own head and uh, yeah, I got it done. But I just wanna say thank you everybody so much for having me here today. Uh, and I also want y'all to know that don't be afraid to reach out to people. There are lots of people that you can reach out to, your friends, your family, this community right here. Um, and also there's the Boys Town National Hotline. They are available 24 seven and they are completely free. Um, and yeah, you can call, chat with them, text them, email them. And yeah, just know that there are people that you can go to because those people will help get you back on the right direction. I love you all very much. Thank you for being here today. And let's rock. Let's play some music. Thank you, everybody.